of a prompt fix to a problem that left many of Nashville's trial court judges furious. Yeah, so News 4 Investigates actually first exposed this, how 20 people charged with murder and other violent offenses were not being monitored by ankle bracelets. So Chief Investigator Jamery Finley is here with basically what happened today. So how did all this work out? Well, when a private company decided on Friday to suddenly stop monitoring these 20 offenders, the city's trial court judges immediately called for a hearing today to discuss what in the world was going on. Here's a little slice of how the judges reacted to the company's decision. You took him off and he's a first degree murder defendant. So there's that. Six Metro, six Metro trial court judges did not hold back this morning criticizing the private company TRM for making that decision to stop monitoring the defendants. Now, we told you last Friday why the company did this. All offenders ordered to wear ankle bracelets are supposed to pay for their own monitoring. But these 20 were not only not paying, they owed at least $600 apiece. Well, because the courts won't pay for the monitoring, the private company determined they could no longer keep incurring debt and notified the courts on Friday that they had turned off the monitoring devices. That obviously did not make the judges happy, reminding the company that they're under a court order and that bail bonding companies should have been notified immediately to gather those 20. Well, the owner of the company apologizing said, saying he misunderstood the process. Yes, I should have dealt with the judges directly, and from this day forward, we will certainly do that with this new understanding. All right, so Jeremy, you do have to at least understand where this company's coming from, right? I mean, they weren't getting paid on this. Well, that's right. It's absolutely true. But the court's message to them, that's not our problem. You are a private company, and you knew from the court order that they agreed upon that the courts did not intend to pay for the indigent offenders. Tracy? What a situation. Yeah. Jeremy, thank you very much.